to the ladies getting me. Um, they, they only have two sizes, and that's a common thing here in Tokyo. Like at least these shops, there's a lot of one size fit all. Good morning. Oh, I woke up to the girls screaming, "Mommy!" <laughs> like really badly. They're just like, "Hello, get me out of bed." You're confusing down with up. Anyway, they got so excited when they heard that daddy got strawberries today. Of course, who's first in line? Kira. No, I'm just saying you're first in line for strawberries. You need to simmer down now. They're all watching the I'm cat showing, cafe episode. Yeah, I'm showing me and Kira the footage because really they're too young to go in there. Mm -hmm. I mean, because they would be Pulling the cats, probably. <laughs> Breakfast is just kind of, you know. It's not just Japanese food that I love having when I'm in Japan, but it's just like regular things, but just taste different. This is yogurt. This isn't the brand my grandmother gets. Uh, so what I like to do is yogurt with blueberry jam because that's what she used to give us uh, for breakfast. We're eating cheese bread from the local bakery right down the street. Some strawberries, look at that! Those girls, they love their fruit. They ate all of those. Still watching Cat Cafe. <laughs> what was that? I love her facial reactions. Kira's just munching down on whatever it is. Man, I think it's bread. I have a special surprise for you guys. For me? Yeah, for you, especially Juliana. You love it. Okay, everyone sit down at the table. Um, if you want to, you can go sit down at the table. Okay. Come on, guys. Everyone close your eyes. Oh, no. My money. It's okay. Close your eyes. Japanese toilet candy. <laughs> I got to open it. We got We got We put water inside. We put water inside. How do you know how much water to put in? One, two, three. You put this inside here. I have no idea what this is gonna taste like. It was blueberries. It smells like gum. Yeah, I smell gum. Okay, can you help me pour it inside? And then. So I just cut this apple and it's smiling right back at me. <laughs> it's the strangest thing. It's quite apple. funny. Right here. He's smiling I at you. I wanted to smile. Oh. <laughs> Mommy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah? I can't play that okay, after this song, I'll play home. <laughs> I just had to show you something. <laughs> this is how considerate they are here in the grocery stores. I bought a bag because I hated reusing or getting more plastic bags. So when this guy was wrapping my strawberries with this small little bag, I was thinking like, what a waste. I like, even if you have your own bag, just to put everything in another bag. The reason he did it was so my strawberries wouldn't get smashed. Honey, look at this. They put air in there to protect it because I had a huge bottle of milk. Wow. Seriously? That is crazy. I have never seen that. I mean, that's so smart. When I when I saw them packing my bags, I realized what why they did this. Unnecessary for me, but definitely appreciated. Thank you, Japanese grocery store guy. Thank you. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> yeah, yeah. Just hopped into the taxi and the seat belts are warmed. Like right when I got it out, it feels like, you know when you take clothes out of the dryer? It feels just like that. Just had an awkward moment because I thought a taxi pulled up right in front of us on, randomly on the street. I well, thought, no, people were getting out. Yeah, I was just assuming it was a uh, taxi because it, it like the driver was in front and they were in the back. And I knocked on the window and the people that got it go, no taxi, no taxi. It must have been their private driver or like chauffeur. Yeah, and I'm like, oh my gosh, how embarrassing. And he sped away too. The guy sped yeah, away. Yeah, like because... <laughs> Cutest little van I've ever seen in my life. Mini size. Mini mini van. <laughs> but before date day begins, time to go to the gym. So this is the gym. <laughs> All this is a little overwhelming. See that is the most fanciest caprese salad ever and I guess these tomatoes. Oh no, the cheese that's somewhere under here. It's from Hokkaido, Japan. It got some delicious food there. Judy also got this panini, ham and cheddar panini, and a side salad. Shoot. Fail. What? I, didn't, I didn't even take an Instagram picture. Oh, Come on. I was so excited about eating. I'm Let's such a eat. noob. I'm so hungry. Honey, you're looking hot. Thanks. I love how they didn't give chopsticks, too. They're like, nope, these are American. Well, <laughs> It is mostly Salad, don't you eat Western food. Anyway? You could, yeah, but. I'm in this little makeup shop that sells clothes and like just girly stuff. And I found the cutest like Jasmine accessories. There's Jasmine makeup. My cousin at the Jazz is obsessed with Princess Jasmine. So I thought this would be cute gifts. Look at this. Disney lip balm. Everything here is so cute, literally so cute. There's Disney perfume with glitter. The jasmine smell actually doesn't even smell that good. It smells like, it smells like baby powder. But Ariel smells really good. <laughs> wow. Oh wow. I kind of fell in love with this jacket. It's definitely faux fur. There's no way this is real. <laughs> What do you guys think? So the lady's getting me, um, they, they only have two sizes and that's a common thing here in Tokyo, like at least these shops, there's a lot of one size fit all. I mean it feels really comfy and everything, but I I don't know, I'm not feeling it 100% but it's still like really cute. It just doesn't compliment my body very well. So. Oh it's okay! Pretty. What are you wearing on your cheeks? Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> and then we are in uh, contact. Lens. Oh, contact. circle lens. Contact. Contact. Oh, mm -hmm. oh, oh, so pretty. <laughs> so cute. Okay. Well, um, I'm not gonna get it, but thank you so much. Thank you so what much. What I got for the time? <laughs> woman shopping heaven right here. Okay. Our date night quickly turned into girls' night out. <laughs> girls' night out shopping, which. I enjoy this because Benji, although he'll wait for me, like I know he doesn't enjoy it. So this is like one of the few times I actually get to go shopping. So I'm going to take advantage. Oh wow. That is cute. These earrings are pretty. I was on my way to the bathroom and look what I find. You can get free water. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's cold, refreshing water. Okay. Thank you, Japan. Thank you, Japan. For being so thoughtful of your shoppers. So, if you need to take care of business and you don't want anybody else to hear you taking care of business, I wonder what they serve at that restaurant. I'm just guessing it's probably crap. Apparently, Elton John is in Tokyo right now. Rumor has it he was trying to use a restroom and everybody was crowding him. <laughs> this is not unique. There's just tons of these streets all over Tokyo. You can find just about anything that you want to eat in this area. And uh, right now, we're working, looking for curry, Japanese style curry. 
Um, one thing you gotta be careful, especially as a tourist, if you don't look Japanese, is there's some places that will deny you service. Okay. Um, uh, it's been a long time since I've been denied service, but I'm usually with my family. So I don't know, they probably make an exception if you're with like a Japanese person. Sometimes they'll just straight up deny you. They go, no, no, no. Even if there's no one in the restaurant. Cold spice curry, that's not Japanese, huh? Oh, it's probably Indian curry. So we're looking for a Japanese curry restaurant and I guess, I don't know, is it supposed to be like fast, considered fast food? Because we can't find it. And we don't want cocoa curry, we want something other than cocoa curry. Shibuya, many years ago, we went to a curry restaurant and it was so good. It was like hidden too. Thank you. Bon appetit. Or, uh, itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. I was wondering. <laughs> this is not Japanese curry. <laughs> I just realized it's not Japanese curry. <laughs> I'm sure it's still really good, but um... Well, it's funny that they have this because this is a Japanese, Japanese. Oh, yeah. It's not a... Yeah. And they have Japanese beer. And the people here are Japanese. Well, because it's Japan. <laughs> <laughs> it's so romantic. <laughs> Thank you. There's like a light show up ahead. We're in the same elevator that Bill Murray was in. If you Google Park Hyatt, loss of translation, you'll see this elevator. Oh, and it gets brighter the higher you go. That's a nice touch. Pretty interesting. The night is still young. It's actually midnight, but I just got done editing and it's our day night. I feel like we should be doing something. Do you want to hit the town or? Maybe we could go. Oh wait, is the bar upstairs closed? Uh, oh, I think it closed at midnight, but really? they had that New York's. Yeah, I think it was open till twelve. Oh wow! We just missed it, but I wanted to hear the live music. Oh, and, are you tired? <laughs> well, we're gonna call it a night for the vlog at least, and then we're gonna enjoy each other's company and do something romantic. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye, honey. Peace.